welcome to the Wana Astani program. Today we are celebrating Krishna's most favorite day, and that is the day Radharani appeared in this world. Today is Radhastami. Chapta Kanchana Gaurangi, Radhe Vrindavaneshwari, Vrishabhani Sitadevi, Pranamami Hari Priye. I offer my obeisances unto Srimati Radharani, whose bodily complexion is like molten gold and who is the Queen of Vrindavana. You are the daughter of King Vrishabhani and you are very dear to Lord Krishna. King Vrishabhani in his previous life was praying, please can the goddess of fortune, Lakshmi Devi, become my daughter. And Kirtita was his wife, praying the same thing. And then one day, King Vrishabhani was plowing in the fields and on a beautiful lotus flower was a tiny golden colored baby. And that baby was Srimati Radharani. Chalasi leaf, chalasi leaf, on Krishna's lotus feet. Tell me the names of the chief gopis. Lalita Vishaka Induleka, Champakalata and Sudevi, Rangadevi Suchita and Tangavidya. But Radharani is the chief gopi. Hurry right bow! There are two wonderful pastimes about Sri Mati Radharani's parrot, which today we are going to tell. Radharani's parrot's name is Shari. I'm Shari, Radharani's parrot! And she's a beautiful parrot who is always with Radharani. So in Vrindavan, there are many, many parrots, and they are all Vrindadevi's messengers. So Shari is always by the side of Radharani. And whenever Shari is sitting next to Radharani, she hears Radharani chanting, Krishna, 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 Krishna. So Shari thinks, if Krishna is so wonderful, I'm going to go to Krishna instead. I'm going to Krishna! 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 So she flies away. And then she goes to Krishna. And when she sees Krishna, Krishna is chanting, Radhe, Radhe, Radhe. And Shari sees he's chanting Radhe, Radhe. And Shari thinks, if Krishna is chanting Radharani's name, it must be be that Radharani is even more wonderful. Then she flies back. I'm going back to Radha, Radha, Radha. All the way to Radharani again and stays by her side. And there's another wonderful pastime where Radha and Krishna were sitting next to each other and then there was a bee. I want to sit on Radharani's ear. She's so sweet. But Radharani was afraid of the bee. No bee, go away, go away. So, Madhu Mangal, who is Krishna's Gopa friend, he said, don't worry Radharani, I will chase the bee away. Don't worry, Radharani, I'll save your life. Get away, get away. <laughs> then Madhu Mangal said, don't worry, Radharani, I chased the bee away and Madhu Sudan will not come back. And now Madhu Sudan, that's a name for the bee. Madhu Sudan means bee, but Madhu Sudan also means, an, is also a name for Krishna. So when he, Madhu Mangal said that, Radharani thought Krishna's leaving and he's not coming back 
And even though they were sitting right next to each other, Radharani thought, Krishna's gone. And she started crying and crying and crying, thinking, Krishna's gone, Krishna's gone. And she couldn't see Krishna through her tears. And she was crying and crying and crying so much, so much that it was creating a big pond. So many tears were coming from her. And when Krishna saw that she was crying so much, he started crying and he started thinking, Radharani's gone, she's gone. And they, they couldn't see each other through all their tears. There were so many tears, they were crying so much. And they were making a big, big pond of water. And then the gopis, they all fainted. And when Shari saw this happening, she realized, I've got to do something about this. So she started chanting, Rade, Rade, Rade. Rade, Rade, Rade. Shuka, who is Krishna's parrot, started chanting, Krishna, Krishna, Krishna. Krishna, Krishna, Krishna. And then when they heard each other's names, they realized, Radharani stopped crying and she realized, Krishna's right here. And Krishna, he realized, Radharani's right here. And then they, they were happy again to be sitting next to one another. And when they looked, they saw that their tears had created a big pool of water. And that pool of water is called Prema Sarovara. This is the, the pool of Radha and Krishna's tears of love for one another. And this place, Prema Sarovara, can still be visited today in Vrindavan, if you go there in India. Jaya Radhe, Jaya Krishna, Jaya Vrindavan, Rasi Krama Bhutamani, Jaya Gopigan. Radhe 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 Sham, Radhe Radhe Sham Sham, Radhe Sham Nirgalana, Mero Vejivan. to Krishna and if she tells Krishna there's a devotee over there who's really trying to please you and this devotee is even better than me then Krishna has to listen and give his mercy <laughs> and what's the best way to please Radharani that's by serving by serving each and every part and parcel of Krishna so serving all of his devotees taking care of the planet taking care of each and every little bug and taking care of each and every person. Oh, Jai Radhe, Jai Krishna, Jai Vrindavan, Rasi Kama Kutamani, Jai Gopigan, Rasi Kama Kutamani, Jai Gopigan. Srimati Rani Rani Ki, Jai. Another way to please Srimati Radharani is by chanting Krishna's holy names, which actually means, please Radharani, please Krishna, engage me in your service. 
So when we chant, we're bringing Radharani and Krishna together. So all of you, put up your arms and loudly call out the wonderful, beautiful names of Radha Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare. Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama.